People. It is I. The guy with the can. Cheers. I'm so ready to play some more Subnautica. But before I do, um, let me remind you of something. While I was playing Outer Wilds, a bunch of you in the comments, maybe jokingly or not, um, were commenting on the fact that I was very distracted all the time while playing and that I had trouble focusing on one simple task, doing all those things. Well, a bunch of you suggested that I may have ADHD, you know? It's possible. I mean, I don't know. I've never been tested for it, but uh, back when you suggested that, I actually did go to the doctor. And I was like, doctor, I may have ADHD. And he's like, why do you think that? And I, <laughs> I told him a bunch of people said so on the internet. Uh, so I'm just here to exclude the possibility, you know, just what's the worst that can happen? So I, uh, he, give, he gives me a, like a piece of paper with a bunch of questions on it that I take home and I have to fill out. And along with some other papers that I have to fill out online. I sent those back and a couple of weeks later I went back to the doctor and he was like, Yeah, you, uh, you have a mild form of ADHD, but it's nothing crazy and it's very, very normal. So I just want to say thank you to all the people uh, suggesting that I should go get checked. I mean, not that it changes much, but now I know that I have a mild form of ADHD. That's it. That's all I wanted to say there. Let me, uh, drink to that. Ah. Alright. Well. Speaking of getting distracted. Let's get started with the game, huh? Played for 5 hours and 12 minutes. Maybe add a couple hours to that. Uh, if we count all the reading I've done. When the game is paused. Dude, I am so excited to play more of this game. I've been thinking about it constantly. I can't wait to scan more things. Learn about the lore. Oh, hey, what? What? What's happening? I kind of forgot uh, where I was. Here we are. Right, look at my beautiful base. And my sea moth. Oh, I love that thing so much. What a great feeling unlocking that, huh? Warning. Emergency power only. Right. Oxygen production offline. I don't have any power in here. Presumably because it's night. So, let me uh, go to the surface. Welcome Actually, I want to try something. What if I just go absolute ham with this? Maximum acceleration. Can I jump like a flying fish? Uh, <laughs> I think I could. It was hard to tell, but... Hey! <laughs> That's awesome. Oh, man. Holy shit, look at how far these lights go. Okay, let's, let's not get too distracted here. You, you piece of shit. I see you. Fuck you. Those little pieces of shit are very, very annoying to me. Okay, man, it feels good to be back in here. What do I want to do? I think I said I wanted to go explore the Aurora last time. And I do. But... I think I may need to... Uh, take care of some quality of life things first. Meaning... Let me go store all my shit in my base so I actually have room. In case I need to pick shit up, you know? So let me go in here. And then make... I want to make more of those lockers. I need quartz for that. I have some, thankfully. Oh, look at all this copper ore. I'm swimming in it. Feels real good. Well, I could make these. They don't require any quartz. Oh, I can sprint. Hell yeah. I can't believe I never tried that. Um... So this is the multi-room. Let me think about how I should organize this. I think I do want the reactor in here. Or maybe I don't, because I do have sunlight, right? Let me add some lockers. It's only titanium, so whatever. Actually, that's not aligned enough. 
Is it daylight again? All primary systems online. Let me go like that. Seek fluid intake. God, I wish there was a... Please let me know in the comments if there's a way to actually make these snap. Because my OCD is not having a good time with this right now. But it is what it is. Let me fill this up with a bunch of shit. And then I'll take out what I need when I need it. Do -do 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 -do. Flare, sea glide. That's good to have. Only 1% charge. Hmm. Kind of useless. That's good for now. Okay, then. A couple fish just went through my base. Uh, I, I do need some water. Tell me I have that here. No. No water. Let me go take, a, uh, go take care of the essentials first, then. I need some water. I need some food. And maybe I also want another health pack. I'm trying to look for salt. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, little guys. Sorry for ramming into you like that. I should be uh, on the lookout for like special biomes, you know? Maybe the salt is only present in very specific biomes. Come here, you. Bastard. Uh oh we have gasopods coming in. Yoink. And you? Gary fish? I'll take it. Uh, bladder fish. I mean, that is water, so... I guess I'll grab my water this way. Uh, I have enough food. Let me get one more bladder fish. There, I see it. Ah, oh, this music rocks. I'm already completely immersed. In the atmosphere and also literally in the water. Hold on. Look in the bottom. I have like four slots. What does that mean? Can I equip certain things in this and use while I'm running around? What's happening? Oh, I thought I thought I thought something was biting at my uh, at my sea moth, but it was the beat of the song, the bass. <laughs> water, water. Oh yeah, hell a lots water. Bunch of food. Actually, maybe I only need two of these. Let me get a Gary fish. Love me some Gary fish. Beautiful. There we go. Full on everything. Vital signs stabilizing. Let's try and go to the Aurora. It's on my to-do list. I have to uh, remind myself where that was. There. All right. <laughs> God, the water is done so well. Also, there's a bunch of things I still want to create, uh, craft. I'm gonna do that later. Let me unpin that. It's annoying me. Hold on, I can repair this, no? It's not full HP. Uh, this one? Let's fix you up. Nice. I also see it has 73 power. So... I wonder what I can what happens when that reaches zero. Does it just go off and how do I refill it with power or recharge it I should say. Uh, 
Here's my life pod. Okay. Let's go. I am definitely getting closer. Look at how big it is now. It's huge. Hold on. Parts of the Aurora? Let me just take a quick look. I'm sorry, my dude. I'm not here to intrude. Just a bit. Well, wait a minute. There's something here. Beacon fragment. Oh. Already had that. Those were the ones I could place. And uh, make them emit a signal, right? A beacon. Hold on. Where was I? Alright. We're going to... Radiation detected. I'm losing HP. Hold on. Do I need to equip this now? Am I good? I think I'm good. I'm not losing HP. Oh my god, look at all this. Oh, there's stuff everywhere. I don't know how much I should explore. Like, how much of this is worth exploring, you know? I mean, I'm gonna explore it all. Metal salvage, don't need it. What's that? Scanner room, already have it. Ooh, biohazard? Nuclear waste disposal? It looks like a trash bin. Hold on. Nuclear waste disposal. Used to dispose of nuclear waste. Well, that makes sense. I can make a vending machine. Is that going to allow me to just keep eating from it? And regain HP? Or uh, fill out my food? That seems crazy. Hmm. I wonder if this is part of the Aurora. It has to be. I mean, we're close to the Aurora now, so... Chances are, it may be. I think everything related to the Degasi, all the wreckage, is close to the Degasi, given how small the ship is compared to the Aurora. The Aurora is huge. Sea Glide, already have it. Okay. Um, I think it was this way, but I'm not entirely sure. I have to go up and look again. I should look at the compass, damn it. Which direction is it? East, southeast. Okay. I'm just exploring a little bit on the way. There's a sand shark. Oh, man. I love swimming around and driving around in this thing. It's so cool. I'm on this... I'm on the floor of the ocean here. Salt? I think I will take some of that. Oh, it's because I don't have my mask on. My rebreather. So east, east, southeast. There's all kinds of things here. What is that? Propulsion cannon. Did I make that? I have it already. No, 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 no. I don't want none of you. Get away from me. 
There's a box right here. A battery! Oh, I needed that. Amazing. That's lucky. I feel like the, the biome is changing. Look at all the sand here. First aid kit. Oh, what is this? Time capsule? These sturdy containers are designed to store written and photographic evidence for later retrieval, in addition to a number of small items. Time capsules are often fabricated by maroon survivors, seeking either to aid those who find themselves in the same predicament in the future, or to leave evidence of their plight, which may be found long after their bodies have disintegrated. Most emergency escape vehicles are equipped with a time capsule by default, usually found in the cockpit and be jettisoned on takeoff. Altera requests time capsules be stocked with tools and resources, which will aid those who may discover them in the future. Okay. Oh shit! Farewell. Fair Farewell. Farewell this amazing planet with its truly dearly and frightening fauna. Farewell Aurora and crew. The only survivor of the Aurora crash. Take Toxie. Hold on, is that like an online element? There were spelling errors, and that sounded like a user. I didn't realize there was on online play in this. I have to check that. I have to check what that was just now. If I have to guess, I think it's an online component of the game. Oh shit, is this it? Oh! <gasps> My god. Wow, listen to the sounds. Sounds like the the engines are running, whatever that means. How do I get inside? Get inside. Maybe I find a hole. This guy indicating caves nearby, huh? Maybe there's a cave I can enter to enter the Aurora. That's the propulsion cannon. I already have that. Sand shark doing its sand sharking. Uh, okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. You're doing very good work. Is this a hole? No, it's a reflection of a stone. Oh! Did you see the electrical sparks flying? Here we go. I see a hole. This is it. Life oh! Readings in this region are oh! The Aurora's radioactive fallout will have devastating effects on the alien ecosystem if not contained within the next 24 hours. What? Sorry, I was too focused. Let me read that again. Life form readings in this region are sparse. The Aurora's radioactive fallout will have devastating effects on the alien ecosystem if not contained within the next 24 hours. Also, another thing to note. Look at the day. It's day 17. When the guy on the sunbeam said that they were a week out, that was on the sixth day or something, or the seventh day. Which means they should have been here on day 14. So, I mean, and they're not here yet. So, hmm. Unless it was just a guesstimate from, from his side. And he wasn't actually sure how long it's going to take. It's just a rough number. Man, did you see that fucking sea snake over here? What's happening?
The whole thing. Oh my god. Saving the game. Definitely saving the game. Oh shit, this is making me very uneasy. Ah, get away from me. Uh, yeah, la, 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 la. Ooh, wait a minute. What is that? Oh, it's just a deposit. Oh my god. Where's the sea snake? That sea snake I saw over there, if it is a snake at all, I think it was the same one that I saw the other time, close to my base, actually. You know, when I was... Ooh. God, I'm getting... Amazing vibes from this. And also literal vibes. Man, I don't know how much of this is explorable. Let me... Okay, do it systematically. Systematically. Let's see what's up here. Man, this ship is fucked. Oh, the shaking is making me very uneasy. Is it structural instability of the crash? Is it gonna collapse at any moment? Or is it that... What, what, what did it say? Radioactive fallout? Right! Radioactive fallout. Oh! That's why I'm wearing my suit right now, right? It's the aurora emitting all the radioactive uh, light. Well, not light, but, you know, charged particles and whatever that damage your body. Warning, ship's structural integrity is low. That's what I said. Suppression equipment and laser cutters may be required. Exploration is conducted at your own risk. Oh shit, I don't have that. Do I? I never made the laser cutter. That's what it's for. Okay, I'm gonna come back. I feel like the game is telling me I need those tools to continue. Uh, let me get out of here. Oh man, I have to come back. This is so cool. Oh, it's so dark now. Fuck. Oh. Oh my god, it's right there. That's not a snake. That's a fucking face. Oh, shit. I don't want to go near that at all. Hold on, what was that? Oh. It's a boomerang. Never mind. Ugh. Fucking sand sharks. God, it's really scary over here. I'm not having any of that. What I am ha having some of is laser cutting. Diamond, I have that. I think I also have cave sulfur, actually. Somewhere. I also, I, I have to make all these tools. And this one. I'm gonna make a fucking arsenal. And then I'll come back. Especially the stasis rifle. Although I did read that it may not work on bigger uh, biologicals. So maybe I should not expect to be able to use it on a reef pack. Or one of those fucking snakes I just saw. Well, they're not snakes. What would I call them? More like... Uh, I don't know. I have no clue what they are. Huge ass anacondas with a face at the end. Hmm. Oh yeah, I also have to go that way. Oh, that's so much to do! Woo! Fuck. I love this game. Here we go. I gotta... Okay, tools first. Then the aurora. And after that, I will explore the... Uh, the other Degasi ha habitat. The one that 
Maurice. No. Um, Marlene. Fuck, what was her name? Marjorie? Suggested uh, they went to. And Paul Torgel was like, no, fuck that, we're not going there. I'm your boss because I have money. I'm important, you know. All that shit. Um, hello. Yoink, you come with me. I did have a little... There it is. Uh, nothing of value in here. Also, the radio is blinking. But let me wait with that. Fire extinguisher, need that. Cave sulfur, I need... One of those. And I think that's it. Then I also need two diamonds, but those are at my other base. And I need some silicone rubber. And then I need a computer chip and a wiring kit. Those are all manageable. Let me go back to my base. This way. So what is needed in a computer chip again? Computer chip, table coral sample, and gold. So I need table coral. Here. I think I have gold. I have plenty of gold. Give me my knife. Also, I, I kind of forgot about this. I made a new knife! Holy shit, look at that! Hopefully I won't burn the table coral. Ooh, did you hear that? Huh. Huh. Uh. Okay, let me try this. I'm sorry, buddy. Okay, I don't want to kill those, actually. Let me try and kill this guy. Cooked peeper. <laughs> Ready for eating. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, I just realized I can uh, unequip things by cl clicking E. Welcome aboard, Captain. Love the view of going through the kelp forest. Honestly, the animation on these kelps are amazingly well done. It really looks convincing, you know? You really feel the underwater environment here. It's so good. Ah, oh my god, all these fishes. I wish they didn't make that sound. It scares me all the time. I think those are reef bags. We're fine. Man, this ship was amazing. This was so much fun to explore. Yeah, the hole is so clearly shown there. I can't believe I couldn't find it for the longest time. Look at this reef bag! That's like a little baby reef bag! You know what? Will you stop it? Come back here. That's right. You saw superior weapons and you fl you fled the scene, didn't you? Passing 100 meters. Oh, welcome. I'm gonna need to take me some copper, I think. And let me grab some. I had some over here. Diamond. Two of those. Magnetite. One. I need one. One more. I can make the laser cutter now. Wiring kit is silver. And the silicone rubber was those green thingies that I don't have right now. I don't have more magnetite. Shit. Make a wiring kit. Mm. Let's create some tools. Laser cutter. 
stasis rifle requires a computer chip. Need gold and copper wire for that. Copper wire. And one gold. I do have that. There it is. Computer chip. I need a battery as well. I thought I had a battery. Hold on. Did I just use it? Damn it. Acid mushrooms. Also, let me make a little hole here. Quartz. There. I like that I can actually do it from both sides. For a second I thought I had to go outside, but good thing I checked. Nice. Um, copper ore, and I need some of those mushrooms. Mushrooms! They should be pretty easy to find, no? They were in the shallow waters. Here. One, two, three, four. Let's make two batteries. Right, I don't have more magnetite. So I can't actually make the stasis rifle. But wait a minute, I'm close to a magnetite source, am I not? Down here is where I found magnetite. Let me quickly take a trip down here. Let me equip my this one. So we're going deep. I think I see some already. No, that's a shale. Oh wait, wait, I can break that. It's a gold. What was that? Lithium. Magnetite. Nice. I'm sorry, Sand Shark. I'll be out of your hair. I'm leaving. Man, look at how much uh, O2 I have now. I can practically stay down here forever. Let's make a battery. Or two batteries. And let's create a... I guess stasis rifle? Oh man, so many new toys! And then I need some titanium. I have plenty of that. Propulsion cannon. Oh my goodness. Motivational note. Craig McGill crash landed in the acid swamps of Boreal 9, fought off arachnid kidney poachers, and hijacked a tame star war. If he can do all that, you can survive one more day. <laughs> Wait, what? Craig McGill crash landed in the acid swamps of Boreal 9. Hold on. I'm just gonna write that down. Craig McGill. <laughs> yes, it swaps. <laughs> Boreal 9. Is that like some fucked up planet? Arachnid kidney poachers. Kidney poachers? <laughs> Wait, he fought off... Spider kidney poachers and a hijacked a tame star wall. <laughs> if you can do all that, you can survive one more day. Dude, I will I will surpass Craig McGill. Okay? Just watch me. I've already been doing some pretty crazy shit while I'm here. Okay? Maybe I haven't fought off arachnid arachnid kidney poachers, but give me some credit, you know? Blueprints, let me unpin all this shit. And let me prepare for my journey into the Aurora now. Let me remind myself what it said I needed to bring. Fire suppression equipment and laser cutters may be required. Exploration is conducted at your own risk. 
laser cutter I have. Um, I guess I won't need this. Let me... Hold on, what did I do? Oh, it's there, it's there. Okay, let me bring only the essentials. This one is nice to have. Propulsion cannon, warps gravity, sure. Freezes physical objects, yeah, let's bring all that. I want to play with those things. Flashlight is good. Lithium, I can store, store all this. Actually, maybe I'll take some of the salt to make some water bottles. Pathfinder tool? Hmm. For now, I'll store it. Habitat builder I can store. I don't think I need it. Flare? Maybe I'll bring that. Useful for distracting certain predators? Maybe that can save my life. Let me actually equip that. First aid kit is good to have. Scanner room hot chip. I guess I can put that on my... Now, let me store that also. Um, I can cook some fish. Let's do that. Let me cook a boomerang. And make some water. Man, I love the feeling of preparing for a, uh, for a trip, you know? We bring the supplies, we get all our equipment ready, change our batteries. I love this feeling of preparation when you're about to go explore something unknown. I love that feeling, it's so cool. Um, okay, let me eat. Eat and drink. And let's go find a little bit of coral. So I can make some more water. There's a coral tube here. Yoink, yoink. Thank you very much. Man, I'm not even scared of these sharks anymore. They're like my neighbors. They're chill, you know? Except they're not really chill, but you get the point. Nice. I can make a bunch of disinfected water now. Let me drink some of this. I guess I can bring these two. And then I also want to quickly just grab a couple fish. What is this? Whole fish. Come here, you bastard. This one I cannot eat. Uh, there. Boomerang. Nice. And another boomerang. Perfect. Uh, cured whole fish. I'm gonna make a cured b boomerang that lasts longer. And I'm gonna cook a boomerang and a whole fish. Man, I am so fucking ready for this trip now. Look at me. I've got everything I need. Amazing. Okay, let's go. Let's do it. Let me save the game while I'm restocked. And let's head to the Aurora. It's gonna be a long trip. this way. So, um, I found out that this game also has a DLC, or I think more accurately an expansion, um, which supposedly is amazing as well. So I'm already so happy about that because I wasn't, I mean, I wasn't quite sure if I was going to like this game. I definitely am now, but because it was a survival game, I was like pretty sure I would like it. In any case, you wouldn't even have seen these videos on YouTube if I didn't like the game. I don't really upload, not even the first couple episodes, if I don't end up liking the game, so... As a rule of thumb, if you see videos on my channel, it means I like the game. 
I mean, who wants to who wants to watch someone play a game they don't enjoy, right? And I also don't want to play the game that I don't enjoy because I don't enjoy it. But uh, man, I'm already excited for the fact that when I'm done with this, there's more in store for me. That makes me happy. Oh yeah, right. Let's put on the mask. Like that. And we're good. East, southeast. Sorry, buddy. Let's go explore the Aurora. Man. You know what I hope? I hope I get to find a million PDAs on board the Aurora. I want to know about the life on board the Aurora. I want to know about the the times that we live in. You know? Supposedly we have inhabited or spread to the entire Milky Way, but also the Andromeda galaxy. So I just want to know more about the whole story and the universe that we live in and the sci-fi that's happening, you know? I hope I get to find stuff like that. Or maybe I'm supposed to turn off... Uh, oh, maybe that's what this is. I think I have to turn off the reactor inside of it so that the radiation doesn't kill everything in the next 24 hours. Because the the PDA told me that, right? Within the next 24 hours, it would, like, it would have killed most of the life here. So how do I get inside? I think there. Hold on. Oh yeah, over there also. Ah, uh, there. Let me park my ship right here. Oh, look at this! Oh shit! Head crabs! Oh god! Uh... Ah, get away from me! I wanna scan you! Cave crawler! There are no caves here. Oh, get away from me. Ah! Fuck. You wanna dance? Piece of shit. Oh my god. This is awkward as hell. You bastard. Oh wait, I have new, t I have new toys. Laser cutter. Flare. I can unequip the flare, I think. Where was my... There was other things. Propulsion cannon. Hell yeah. Sea glide I guess I don't need right now. Uh, didn't I also have a stasis rifle? The hell? Oh! Oh, look! Yeah, fuck you! Hold on. Why can't I not kill it? There we go. It's a little bit finicky, the... The melee combat here. Oh my god! Look! It gets stunned when it goes inside! That's right, bitch. Ah! Oh, get away from me! No, come back! I need to kill you. Bro. There we go. Battery. I was about to say, doesn't this knife require a battery? What the hell is this? Oh. Fuck you. Ah! Uh, release? 
Oh, it didn't die. Look, it's still alive. Load item from inventory? Shoot a flare? Wait. Flare? Fuck, where did it go? I think I shot it into the second dimension here. Uh, let's shoot it into this guy. Actually, I think I killed it. Fuck you. Oh, this thing is amazing. Although it does require a lot of power. Look, only 72% power already. Fuck you. Into the fire with you. <laughs> this is so fucking cool! Bastard! Into the fire with you. Have fun. Water! So, am I going the right way? I mean, I'm following the crates here. Maybe I can do uh, two birds with one stone. Oh my god, there's so many. Is it worth killing them? Oh, they're not even dead. Fuck. Yeah, yeah, sure. Ah, fuck all of you. I'm running through you. I don't care. I don't care! 